What's up guys? Today we're back with another viewer mail video. This is going to be a pretty epic mail video. We have a few packages. I don't know what they are. My camera actually exploded. So I opened one package already. I'm going to show you what was in there. But first the giveaway for this video. An ultimate rare blue eyes white dragon. The only ultimate rare printing in English. So it's pretty cool. All you got to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite piece of mail. We're planning on a pretty awesome 40,000 subscriber video and also that big purchase I said I made and then I was like, well, it might not might have fell through. It didn't fall through. So there's going to be some pretty epic videos regarding that coming up. So make sure you guys keep your eye out for that. Subscribe to get to 40,000. It's going to be pretty awesome. Really close. Really close. It's going to be pretty awesome. So let's go over the mail that I already opened and it blew up on me. So we have Dear Ruxin, the card in this envelope. Horn is the rarest card I own. I wanted you to have it. Use it wisely. So we have... So he sent me a uh, Horn of the Unicorn. Very good condition. Very rare. Very expensive. Yeah, so... Uh, so there's that. Then he sent me another one. It said, Ruxin is the goat. Enjoy the cards. Use them for a giveaway. Keep or sell. Viewers, if you enjoy my content, consider following. I do tons of awesome giveaways and sales and collection posts. Instagram, Ahami Yu-Gi-Oh. So that's pretty awesome. Check out Ahami Yu-Gi-Oh on Instagram. He sent me some pretty good stuff and here's what it is. Oh, did I ruin it? This is just a random cover card. Check this card out that he sent. When I first saw it, I was like, oh wow, that's really cool. I don't know what it is though. Like, is that Korean? Is that what that is? And then 15th anniversary, that's what it looks like. I don't know where this came from, but it looks incredible. Time Wizard from Dual Terminal, that's super cool. Then a, I can't remember this, I can't remember the card's name, but this is an Italian version from Return of the Duelist, so that's really cool. And then this one's really cool. That is probably not appropriate, but uh, kind of funny. <laughs> then we have a Fenrir, which on the front looks normal, but then the back is like this. And it looks fake, because it's so red. So I want you guys, let me know if you guys think this is fake or not. The front looks really real, and I don't really see many... Invasion of Chaos fake. So the front, like the text is everything looks normal. So like just the redness just reminds me of those fake LODs. But I'm pretty sure this is a real card. So AM and Yu-Gi-Oh, thank you for that. Sorry I cut out on my initial reaction, but that was really cool. Next thing, we have a piece of paper. Yes, a piece of paper. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. On to the next thing. We have... The instructional CD video, Yu-Gi-Oh! Complete Exodia set, exclusive review, English Labyrinth of Nightmare set. Okay, who sent me this? There's no there's no note. There's just the piece of paper with nothing on it. What is this? This one is from uh no oh Neil. Neil, thank you. Yes, I remember him messaging me and telling me he was gonna send me this. So this is like really cool. What is this? Oh, here it is. Here's the note. Alright, we have Happy Holidays, Ruxin34. Hope 2021 brings some epic pulls for your channel. I hope so. Keep up the good work, and thanks for the content, Neil. So yeah, we nailed it. It was Neil. <laughs> he sent us... Ooh, cool. A Crystal Dragon Gold Seeker Rare. That thing is very secret, very gold. And then we have this epic uh, magazine. Let me know if you guys would actually want to see me go through this sometime. There's some really cool stuff in here, like, oh, look. Exodia Forbidden, Forbidden One Ultra Rare, $53. Guy the Dragon Champion, $44. Metal Raiders, the whole first edition set, $425. I think that would actually be pretty cool to go through because the prices were wild back then. But that's pretty cool. That is actually really cool. So I love this kind of stuff. Fortunately, it's a little bit too big for the camera. I'd have to adjust the camera. But that is really, really awesome. All right, next we have... Okay, I'm not sure who this one's from. The name is Bro from Puerto Rico, so or from PR. So I'm guessing that means from P Puerto Rico. That's my big-brained guess right there. So let's see what's inside. Let's see what he sent us. Okay, there is a read me message. Read me. I will. Hello, Ruxin34. Hope you're having a nice one. Love your channel. It's been a blast, specifically during this pandemic, which I am grateful for. My wife and I, thank you for bringing us cool openings, surprises, and awesome content. Keep up the awesome work. As for the fan mail, I try to be as anime accurate as possible. I know they may not be real or official, but I consider them the most lucky charmed cards, not to mention great items for collection. Use them as you see fit. If you're not familiar with these, as a heads up, they're known as Orica cards. They have their own nice community. Hope you like them, bro. Take care and a big love from Puerto Rico. Sincerely, the bro from Puerto Rico. Do you see that? You guys see that? Puerto Rico. I knew. <laughs> okay. So let's see. It looks like these are going to be Oricas. So front side of the cards. So let's let's start with the upside down real quick. Anime accurate. So I'm, I'm guessing these will be pretty cool. 
The Son of God Dragon. <laughs> Interesting. That is actually really crazy looking. Check that out. I'm guessing that's the chant. And then the back. The, uh, the dual monsters. Back. That's really cool. Okay. Oh, wow. These are all going to be god cards. There's only three. The God of Obelisk. The player shall sacrifice two bodies to the God of Obelisk. The opponent shall be damaged. And the monsters on the field shall be destroyed. 4,000, 4,000. And then finally, Saint Dragon, the God of Osiris. Osiris. Every time the opponent summons creature into the field, the point of the player's card is cut by 2,000. X stands for the number of the player's cards in hand. So that is an Orica, an Orica God card set. That's actually really cool. So these are not real cards. Oricas are just fan-made or they're made to be fake, but they're just really cool. You know, they're not actually real Konami cards. So they're a little bit different, but that is really cool. So thank you for sending those. That's pretty awesome. Thanks, bro from Puerto Rico. Let's go to the next thing. And this is going to be... I Oh, I got this one yesterday and I was not sure what it was. All right, we have a note here. A note that says... Big fan of the channel. You are killing it and making a ton of growth. It's crazy to think your fan base wouldn't fit into the most college-sized stadiums. Sorry for the trolling. We do it for the content. Keep up the great work. Stay sincere and the fans will come to you. Keep on improving and growing. I know you will. Ben. P.S. Included is a first edition Star Deck Yugi Curse of Dragon. I was hoping you'd sign it and mail it back. Your favorite card from my first product. Either way, thanks. So we have a first edition Star Deck Yugi Curse of Dragon that he wants me to sign, which uh, I can probably do that. But if it's you know if this gets rampant, you guys might have to uh, <laughs> help me out with all the shipping. But I can I can do that. All right, and we have it's a note. Read me on air, Ruxin. I am a big fan. Included are a few 2004 packs. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. I don't see what the big deal is about DDS promos. Included is one. What? <laughs> I'm guessing I'm guessing it's not a Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, or, or uh, Exodia. Also, I challenge the Ruction fan base to get him 50 states of Bacanio Moth. Included is the Wisconsin rep. All right. So uh, does that mean they have to come from all 50 states? That would be kind of wild. So we have a Bacanio Moth from Wisconsin. So we have exclusive pack. So inside, this has the same... Uh, um, Promos in it every time. It has like the Athene and the Great Sphinx, the An And Andro, and then the something else. So we're probably not going to open these because we know what's going to be. Maybe we'll open one of them. We'll keep two of them. Let's just do that so we can show what's in there, and then we'll keep the other two because like they're all the same. So there's no point in opening more than one. Yeah. So we have the uh, Sphinx Tele Telea, Andro Sphinx, Athene the Great Sphinx. Then you got Return from a Different Dimension, Inferno Tempest, Familiar Knight. Pet in the Dark Clown, and Rare Metal Dragon. So that's in all of the exclusive packs. I don't really understand why they did that. If you, any of you guys know why they kind of just made it as like the same every time, let me know. So that's pretty cool. Then we have a few cards he sent us. Supposedly a DDS promo, so we'll, we'll see what that is. First of all, we have Pequeno Moth with a piece of cheese on its head. <laughs> and then a, well, he's from Wisconsin, so that makes sense. I understand. And then uh, Penguin Soldier, the classic. That's first edition Star Deck Yugi, so that's pretty cool. Check out that sleeve. Then we have, what is this? First edition Dark Crisis, Judgment of Anubis. That is insane. Another Pequeno Moth, Niwatori, classic. There is the DDS Salamandra and a Trial of Hell first edition. That's actually really cool. So this is some really nice cards that he sent. First edition secret rare from Dark Crisis. That's really cool. So that's really nice mail. So thanks for sending that in. And he challenged you guys 50 states of Pequeno Moth. So uh, up to you guys to do that. So uh, we'll see if you guys can handle it. Finally, we have one. This is not like a mail day or like a mail package. I actually bought this one. And you guys kind of know about it. But it is for the 40,000 subscriber special. Which hopefully will be on time. And hopefully will contain everything that I said. You know, so just... Subscribe for 40,000. Just do it. All right. We have. Let's see if we can get in here. Inside, we have another first edition Legend of Blue Eyes pack. Oh, yeah. First ed LOB. Let's check it out. Okay. The, what in the world is going on back here? Why is it like this? That's a little bit weird. 
Hmm. I don't know why it's like that. I'm gonna have to ask some people, like, if that's a bad sign. Because... I don't know, I've never seen it, I've never seen a pack like this before. It's like... In the middle, that's super strange. Okay, how's it look in there? Okay... I don't know. I don't know. I really can't. I really don't know if something's wrong with it or not. Ooh, what is that? Um, that doesn't look too good. This looks like very something yeah I don't I don't know about this pack yeah what's up with that hmm I'm gonna have to ask some people about this I uh, I don't feel too good about this pack but we have a first edition LOB pack it looks a little bit strange but, uh, yeah, you guys can let me know what you think about it in the comments. But overall, thank you guys for sending in stuff for viewer mail. It's pretty awesome. Appreciate all you guys for sending in really cool stuff. And that's it for today. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Okay, oh. Elemental Hero Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs>